Enjoy the show. Thank you. Come on in. Head on down. Watch your head. Watch your step. Coming down. Step slide me now. Here you come. Here you come. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Amalgamated Shows and Undead Touring Company, LLC et al., we present our event, Molux Midway and the Cabinet of Infernal Mysteries. The attractions we have for you tonight are as strange as any, stranger in fact than most, most unusual and dying to make your acquaintance as well. First up, who is he? Where did he come from? And for God's sake, why, damn it, why? Presenting the illustrated King of Pain! Amazing! Wow. What's next? As you know, our universe is no narrow thing, and it's not constrained by any latitude to repeat in one part what exists in any other part. Here, before you now, without precedent or analog, for your viewing and positively alive, strange seductress of the sea, the octopus girl! If much of the world is mystery, then its limits are not, for it is boundless and limitless, and contains creatures more horrible and beings that man has no laid no eyes upon. Had you not been born to it, thereby bleeding of it, bleeding it of its strangeness, you would see it for what it is: a fevered dream, a hat trick in a medicine show, a trance be populate of chimera, an itinerant carnival, a traveling tent show whose ultimate destination, after many a pitch in many a muddy field is unspeakable and calamitous beyond reckoning. Please enjoy the show. Step down this way. Please step carefully. <laughs> Greetings, little one. You have come to Baba Yaga asking what fate holds in store for you. Give me your hand and I will follow its paths. Though I should tell you, it is often better not to know such things. <laughs> Please remember, for an accurate reading, it's very important that you keep your hand in my possession at all times. Oh yes, your hand is whispering to me now. You will soon face a puzzle that you cannot solve alone. It will cause much pain for you and someone close to you. Oh, little one, much strife lies in wait for you. For someone you trust will betray you and will lead you astray into a danger from which there is almost no chance of escape. Lean closer now, and I will share with you a secret that will help lead you to safety. But in exchange, I must take something from you. Something very precious and dear. Just hold still, my little one. Well, welcome to Funland. Darlene will be right there. Are you there, Darlene? Step right up and spin the wheel of misfortune. That's right, you can spin the wheel of the deal. Learn your fate before it's too late. Now. Alright, grab the girl and give her a Oh, that was a pitiful spin. Yeah, you gotta do that. <laughs> it's a horrible way to go. Oh, no, it's all my favorite. Now, who's gonna be next? We got a new game over here. You, come on. You got a token? Who's got a token? I got a token. Just put it in, grab the, the pole, give you, the handle a squeeze. I don't know if I want to do that. Oh, you can do it just like in high school. Come on. Right here? You have a firm grip. Yep, and just squeeze the handle. <laughs> squeeze the handle, too. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> you 
we do like our fun here in the fun line. Now, if I can direct your attention over to this red curtain here, we have ourselves here our very own peep show. <coughs> Excuse me. Now, who's going to be the first for the peep show? You're going to. You're our volunteer. You're first in line. Come on. Right through this red curtain. Yeah, turn on that sexy music, Darlene. Degenerate fun here in Funland. Who's next? <laughs> Go on through. Molax 
past Midway, and you look like you're a pretty good shot, aren't you? Oh, well, well, why don't shot? you go ahead and take it a shot, take a shot, take a shot. Why don't you uh, go ahead and try and aim for this crow right here. Oh, that was a pretty good shot. That was a pretty good shot. Here, let me, uh, let me reward you with a <laughs> Who wants to go next? How about you? How about you? Yeah, why don't you, why don't you go ahead and take a shot at the, uh, the, 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 the candle over there. It's a little, it's a little to the right. You gotta hold down and squeeze on your, on your hand. There you go. That's a pretty good shot. Yeah, That's a pretty good shot. I'm Carney Hyde, man. Uh, the bird around the croakers of Texas. Who's next? Who's next? How about you? How about you? There you go. There you go. Why don't you take a take a shot at my friend over here? You gotta hit him in the noggin. You understand? Oh God! Oh, what is the matter with you? You shot me! What the God damn it! All right, you, 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 you all lose. You leave. You leave. You leave this one here with me. She's mine now. That's right. That's right. <laughs> I hope you've been enjoying yourselves here at the Power to the Grand Cabinet of the Yes. My name is Dr. Apocryphopinacrosis. I'm a learned, <laughs> learned gentleman of medicine and other olfactory, olfactory whatnots and occult wisdoms. I'd like to tell you some stories about my travels far and my travels wide. My travels to the deep and the dark. In a, I was in India and saw the Aghoris. They live amongst the graveyards, and their sense of smell for dead flesh is quite acute. And together with my, my herbal knowledge contained in my healing tonic, which is available for sale upstairs for only $15 for a lifetime supply, see the vendor on your way out, I have developed the ability to sniff out the dead flesh within, within the living, for that is where disease comes from. And with the aid of my tonic, I can reach in and pull it out, thus curing the disease. Now, I'd, I'd like to give you a demonstration, free of charge, and heal you of all your maladies with a demonstration of my healing tonic. You, sir, you, you look. You look like you're afflicted. Here, have a have a seat, gingerly, gingerly. Have a seat. Now lie lie down, lie down. <laughs> lie back. I shall cure all all of your diseases. You're not allergic to any medications or anything, are you? Without any tools, I shall attempt to make an incision within your abdomen. Reach in and pull out the tumor which is afflicting you. Do you believe me? Can you feel? Let me have a swig of my, my tonic. Where is my tonic? <laughs> yes. <laughs> and there, I have extracted the tumor. You should be feeling okay within the next day or so. <laughs> you have lots of rest and the soreness will pass now. I see that you are VIPs, and I'd like to extend to you gratis a complimentary sample of my healing tonic to try amongst you. And now, for the conclusion of your amazing evening here, I'd like to show you the most amazing exhibit here. If you'll just step this way up the stairs, you'll see the great egress, the most amazing... Oh my god! Oh my god! Run! Run while you still can!
Thank you.